This is Gordon Now, aka World of Depth, and today I'll show you, in 3D, how to explore out of bounds in the VR game Apex Construct as played on Oculus Quest 2. You are watching the parallel stereo pair version of this video. If you'd like to switch to Cross Eye, Anaglyph, or a version for 3D TVs, see the description below. So, the key to going where you're not supposed to go in this game is the teleport system. So normally, when you're playing through the game, you can't just teleport on top of a building or out a window. However, it so happens that sometimes if you teleport on top of a table or a rock or another nearby object, sometimes that will raise you high enough that you then can teleport out a window. So I'm going to show you two example videos, and these are both from the safe house level of the game. So in this room, you can't reach those high windows, but you can reach on top of this machinery bank, then you can lean over and reach this pipe, and now you can reach the window, teleport out of it, and go over here and appreciate this beautiful view, which you can't really see from indoors. Unfortunately, you can't teleport farther than this out there. But you can turn around, explore the top of this building. You can look down into these skylights to see where we just came from. You can see these glitching textures around. And you can go over here and say hi to your birdie friend. Notice that building behind the bird there is almost completely missing, but you can see the stairs leading down, and you can see that poster floating on an invisible wall. So this is the idea. You can see the blue lamp that I've left where we were just standing, but now I'm going to show you how to get to this building and get a room there. First, we're going to want to get on top of this mattress or something, then on top of this crumbling wall, and from here on out, it's basically a series of finding a series of teleportable spots and leapfrogging your way to where you want to go. Sometimes it takes a little bit of searching around to find a spot, and sometimes a little bit of backtracking like I'm doing here to reach somewhere. And once you get up this high, you'll notice things like buildings without lower halves, floating trees, a lot of invisible textures, and this leads to things like sometimes teleporting out onto empty space as it appears. Here, for example, here's a series of rocks that are missing textures on their outer side where the player normally doesn't see them. But if you teleport onto the top of this pile of rocks, you get about the highest you can get on this level, I think. It's a long way down to the safe house below. And you can get a closer look at that clock tower that looks quite hazy from below. Again, floating building pieces, trees. Behind you, there's this big overpass and this office building or something. But here's the building I was talking about. So it happens that behind the windows in most of these buildings are actual small modeled 3D spaces. So if you get close enough, yes, you can teleport inside them. And here, as promised, is the room with a view. Hope that made sense. So if you try this yourself, please let me know in the comments where you managed to go. So here's a sneak preview of part two, where I'll show you how to get where you shouldn't on the CARF level of the game. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe for more, leave me any questions in the comments, and remember, everything is better in 3D.